Have you ever wondered how particles behave when a perfume is sprayed or a tea bag is dipped in the water? A drop of ink or spreading of food colors in the water are the examples of a very well-known phenomena known as diffusion. It is defined as the movement of molecules from a region of higher concentration to a region of lower concentration to form a homogeneous mixture. Rate of diffusion depends on two factors temperature and molecular mass. To explain the effect of temperature on rate of diffusion, let's take a balloon filled with the air in which the particles are constantly moving. On heating this balloon, the particles gain more kinetic energy and their movement increases resulting in bursting of balloon. This simple experiment shows that the rate of diffusion increases with the increase in temperature. To study the effect of molecular mass on the rate of diffusion, let's take a glass tube. Its one end is sealed with a cotton plug soaked in ammonia solution, and other end is sealed with a cotton plug soaked in concentrated hydrochloric acid. Both the gases diffuse along the tube and white fumes of ammonium chloride are formed where they meet. The white fumes appear closer to the end containing hydrochloric acid. So, the ammonia gas has traveled greater distance than hydrochloric acid. If we look at the molecular masses of hydrochloric acid and ammonia, it appears that the particles in hydrochloric acid are almost twice as heavy as those in ammonia gas. This clearly shows that the rate of diffusion decreases with the increase in molecular mass. If one releases a bunch of balloons, some of them fly up in the air while others fall back to the ground. This is because they are filled with different gases, helium and carbon dioxide. Molecular mass of helium is 4 and that of carbon dioxide is 44 grams per mole. Lighter the gas, faster the diffusion, and heavier the gas, slower will be the diffusion. Thus the helium balloons diffuse faster than the balloons filled with carbon dioxide. And since helium is lighter than air, that's why helium balloons rise in the air instead of falling back. Mm -hmm.